hey guys welcome back or welcome to my youtube channel today i'm pretty excited because i want to show you this hair that i received from dy hair 777 so this hair i was very excited to try because that's totally my style like the texture of the hair is exactly what i like and everything like that so inside the bag you will get hair care tips and all their contact information you will also get amazing free lashes like that's the favorite part and here is the lace front wig so when you open the wig it's very like nicely uh, put together and you can see it's very long i took peruvian hair in 24 inches the hair is one 180 percent density and you can feel that the hair is very strong like i like the fact that it's strong and it stays straight like the hair is amazing that's completely my style because i usually wear my hair straight and that was something that i really like and the density is like perfect because it's a natural look it's not like you have not enough hair but it's very thick like you have enough hair to do all the hairstyles that you want and i don't know if you see how good is the quality of this hair but that was actually something that i really like and appreciate so the hair color was 1b but i wanted it in color one so i went on and colored the hair in total black and did the knot so i bleached the knot and this is the final result i know it looks not pretty beautiful inside but you can see how the wig is made and it's pretty secure there's like four clips or three of them and as you can see it looks very very natural when i put it on my skin so i was very happy about my work and i was finally almost ready to put it on my head Okay, for this you will need the got to be glued, ultra glued, like the black one, and then this got to be spray. And then if you want to keep it more than like a few days, you can use the ghost bond. And here's the wig caps that I use. This is how I actually cut my wig caps before I put it on my head. And the link to those wig caps will be in the description down below because it's a great color if you're someone with... A darker skin tone okay so now we are ready to install the wig what I did first is that I put the gut to be glue on my skin like around my face where I, where exactly where I want to put my wig cap and that's what you can see right here and then after i put the wig cap with the glue uh, i put again another layer of glue on the top of my wig cap like on the line between my skin and my wig cap then you put some glue there and at the end as you can see here you're ready to install the wig and you have to let it dry if you don't have like time to be patient me i had time while i was doing it you can use a hair dryer and it's gonna be totally fine so right now as i'm finishing like i'm pressing the hair with my little comb to make sure that the wig is nicely installed and as it's gonna get like perfectly installed you will feel it that it feels secure and as it will dry then you will see that it's perfectly done now what i'm gonna do is that i'm gonna cut the the frontal uh, i think it's better to cut the frontal when it's on your head already so you can do exactly what you need to do and even if it doesn't like stick exactly on the glue you can later on put a lot more glue on top of it and this hairstyle will last you for like, let's say four days
Now that everything is all in place and everything looks good, it's time to do the baby hair. So I have no special skills in doing the baby hair whatsoever, but I just take a little scissor, I cut my baby hair, then I try to make something nice with it. I take a toothbrush, one that I don't use eventually, and I try to make the baby hair like stay in place like perfectly but what can I say is that I don't like too much baby hair so I'm gonna do just a little bit of it I'm not gonna go extra on it and it's not perfect but I think it's it's it looks good anyways my hair will be hiding most of it the way that I usually wear my hair but yeah that's what we are doing and this hair is very easy to work with so you won't get any problem with that then when you're satisfied with the result, you kind of want to put a kind of a headband and leave it on for let's say 30 minutes or something like that, 15 to 30 minutes. At this point, it's the time to do the line and pluck the hair. So I'm gonna be plucking and I'm not gonna be plucking way too much because I'm the kind of person that I'm gonna be scared that I'm gonna not gonna get enough hair. I don't want to take off too much hair. So my line is pretty like natural. Anyways, I'm gonna put some um, concealer on my hairline after that so it's gonna look even more natural but you can pluck as much as you want you can even pluck like on the frontal everywhere but I just did a line and that was good with me Now I'm going to take a hot curling iron or you can even do that with a hot comb and comb like on the top of my hair because I want it to lay very flat. If you want to make anything else after it's gonna be okay but to make your hair lay very flat you can use that trick. Now here's the funny part, to lay my hair flat I use the Dove Men deodorant like on all the little hair that up and it, do, it does the trick without being a gel, you know? And here's the final look! Yes! <laughs> now let me show you some little quick hairstyles that you can make with this hair. And I love, love, love the quality of the hair. And the color was very great, like the black took very well and I was happy about it. And yeah, that's it. Let me show you a few hairstyles. And yeah, so that's it for today. Please make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.